please allow me to provide you with some background information as there are rumors that they are thinking of selling their opulent villa, and the reasons behind this decision are quite shocking. Hi, and welcome to this place where we provide you with the most recent information on your favorite celebrities and royals. If this is your first visit, please be sure to enable alerts and subscribe. It appears that Meghan and Harry were spending their money on the paparazzi when they were recently captured on camera. One article claimed they were putting on a big show to keep up the appearance of success and to continue living a luxurious lifestyle. The thing that shocked me the most was how far beyond their means they were. However, reports state that Harry has been declared insolvent by the Bank of England. Still, exercise patience. The narrative that ran alongside the essay hinted at the likelihood that its occupants would soon be sold, but only under the proviso that they remain under further isolation. This is where your reputation as a valuable audience member becomes even more important. How soon Harry and Meghan have enough money to stop their gorgeous house from going up for auction is what matters. The prince and his spouse have reportedly left Frogmore Cottage, according to Buckingham Palace. The keeper of the privy purse stated that the status of Frogmore Cottage was discussed on Thursday, the day after the annual sovereign grant report was made public, during a press briefing. The Duke and Duchess are currently residing in Frogmore Cottage. After deciding to leave their position as royals and move in 2020, the couple was required to repay money from the sovereign grant. According to Stephen, the Duke and Duchess have covered the sovereign grant's costs associated with Frogmore Cottage renovation. The couple was asked to vacate the Windsor Great Park property, and the son reported that Prince Andrew, the disgraced younger brother of King Charles III, could move in, leaving the crown with a greatly enhanced asset. A source close to the couple claims that Stevens would not comment on whether Andrew will appreciate the remodeled Gioran era home. They're relocating to Malibu. The couple reportedly wants to move closer to Los Angeles, so they are looking at homes in the coastal city. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are reportedly considering moving to Malibu. They have visited the area in secret on a few occasions, but it's unclear if she will give up her current Monterio home and move back to her Hollywood roots or add a Malibu property to their collection. According to the source, Malibu's appeal to the celebrity set makes this a calculated move, which brings us to our consideration. The pair has been residing in their mansion in Monito ever since they left their royal duties. The couple's agents declined to provide a statement. The future bride, who is rumored to be preparing a return to the entertainment industry, may be purchasing a new residence in the center of the business. To achieve her goals of becoming a global entrepreneur, she collaborated with William Morris Endeavor. Author of The King Christopher Anderson said in a May interview with Fox News Digital that he saw this new affiliation as a step towards his goal of becoming a major player in the entertainment industry. Anderson stated that he anticipated Meghan to be the host of a daytime talk show syndicated. It wouldn't be shocking to see her go into media and do similar things as Oprah Winfrey, such as starting a magazine, hosting a show, producing, directing, and more. Despite recent setbacks, Anderson claims that Shah and the couple still have a sizable fan base. An expert on royalty claims that the media empire appears to be collapsing. The music man claims the couple's future content plans could be a disaster.